YouTube rubber here. Today I wanted to tell you my advantages and disadvantages of using two fishing poles. See right here I'm using two fishing poles. My number one tip is try to get your fishing poles uh, close together like that so you can keep an eye on both of them and they're both of them are right in front of my feet so if one was to get slammed I can hurry and, and get it and you know because if you have one over here for example and one over here for example then you gotta walk back and forth you risk your rod going into the water and it's just it's just a pain in the butt now to the advantages and disadvantages I think my first advantage, let's go with advantages first. It's, you can try different baits with one of them. You can cast it into a different spot, like say you found a spot that you want one rod to stay at and then you want to try a different spot because maybe, maybe you saw some fish rising at the surface or something. You have that uh, advantage. And then the second advantage, is like I mentioned it already, is that you can use a different bait and uh, and you can use yeah I mean you can try different stuff with one rod and then use the, a bait you know works in your spot with the other now the disadvantages now this is only my personal uh, opinion uh, disadvantages is is it's happened to me before where both poles were getting a bite at the same time that's a disadvantage because you're focusing on one that's hitting harder and then as you're working on setting the hook on that one your uh, your other rod could be getting a, a, like in, say you're in the middle of reeling in a fish you got hit really hard you know and then the other one's still getting slammed you set that one rod down yeah, it could just that's it could just be a catastrophe. It could just be a pain in the butt. It'll be a lot of fun. Don't get me wrong. It is a lot of fun when both of your bulls are getting a bite at the same time. It's a lot of fun. But to me, that's a disadvantage. And then another one is that you risk uh, your lines tangling with each other. Uh, where in this case, where I'm fishing. Is I have one just barely cast it out over here and then I have this one way out in the middle there is current but there is no way these two lines are going to tangle and once again I'm leaving the two rods close together so I can watch them both close together thanks for watching and like if you like and subscribe if you haven't already and have a good one